about eight trees. So that's not bad. I mean, we're not and we're not moving fast. So you know, and I did that today and then still mowed my lawn and uh, still cleaned out the gutters and still did the laundry and, you know, all that other good stuff. So, uh, yes and no. Um, firewood for burning inside of a house. I don't have a wood burner inside the house, um, but I do, um, I, I like, I, I do have a bonfire pit. So, and me and the girl like to uh, sit out at night, um, you know, sit by the, sit by the bonfire, you know, uh, get some marshmallows out you know all that good stuff and uh or you know just nice peaceful it's nice and quiet i mean uh with me and my kids we uh uh son gets out the telescope and uh you know sit by the sit by the fire and look at the international space station or any of the stars that are you know really close or whatever like that and it's a uh, just really good time so I should get a fireplace for inside my house. Uh, the problem is, is trying to find insurance companies that are um, um, nice to you, so you don't have to uh, pay an arm and a leg for the extra insurance. So. Um, Yes, but not, um, you don't have to, um, see a chimney goes through the entire house. Um, all, all it needs is to be ventilated. Um, and in order to do that, like it, let's say if I want to put it like in my garage, uh, it's not going to go straight up. It would go like just straight out, straight out. And then it can go up on the outside. Um, and it just has to be uh, triple wall, um, ductwork which is what um, a chimney really is. It's just triple wall ductwork and then it's brick brick around it so it looks better. You don't see a big metal pipe going up, but that's all a chimney really is. Um, so in order to do all that, I mean, uh, all it has to do is just go outside the house. So um, like if I, if I did it, I, I would obviously put one in my basement. Um, so what it would do is just, I would get a metal pipe and probably put it out toward the back of my house and just go up with it. Um, and go from there. Um, I mean, yeah, I could get a brick around it, I guess, if I wanted to, but um, wouldn't wouldn't really fit that well with the house. Good to see you. Can I help you? Care to trade? Sure. What do you need? All right, let's sell all our milk. Let's sell all but 10 of our eggs. So we got 53, so we'll sell 43. Okay. Um, what do you have? You have a drone with a camera. I don't know what that would be used for. I had to go, had to go first look that makes sense though. My dad has a wood burner in a garage that vents them out, has another vent that goes inside of it. Yep, yeah, that's, that's all you gotta do. Um, so, I mean, is it something I, 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 I can do? Yeah, I, I can. Um, so, uh, it's probably something that I will do. Just, I don't know when. Uh, it's one of those things where, um, I have lots on my uh, to-do plate and um, either uh, time or um, money is, an, uh, is the issue, you know, so. All right, let's see if we can get our dog here. Where are you going? Come on, Rex. Can I give you another one? No? Okay. So I got you closer, so we got to come back every day. All right, got to come back every day. <sighs> Don't run me over, man. Yeah, the one thing I think I'm going to do before I do the the wood burner, though, is um, uh, I got to get a generator. 
Um, this year was uh, this year was bad on power outages and stuff. Um, the storms were just uh, really bad. A lot of wind damage and uh, stuff like that. I have a generator, but I don't have a whole house hookup. So I'm going to have to do that. And uh, I want to get that done before winter, definitely. So that way, at least with the power goes out, I can still have heat. And my pump can still run, and my sump pump can still run, my well can still run, you know, stuff like that. So, um, um, because I want to say that's a little bit important, just to make sure I have heat for the winter. So, uh, yes, I know we're talking about, you know, putting a chimney in, but um, I'd have to get a lot more wood if I was going to burn wood for heat. And I really don't want to get a couple cords of wood and start splitting caught and, you know, doing all that in October. So wouldn't have much time to get it ready and uh, who knows that the wood would be uh, seasoned enough to where it'd be ready to burn. It should be, but we'll start with having a get together tonight. It was fun catching up. I'll cut you Hey, not a problem, man. Anytime. Uh, good luck on the house and uh, I, um, hopefully uh, it doesn't take you too long to get moved in. And um, you know, um, next time we talk, um, hopefully we'll, you'll be at your new house. So congratulations and uh, good luck to you. Anytime, man, anytime. Here we're gonna have to get some gas. Well, that is cool. He's on his way to his new house. But well, that is good. That is real good news right there. We should all congratulate uh, Cox Gaming there for his uh, purchase of a new house and um, starting to. Really get his dream going here. So, and then hopefully everything works out with him and the girl. And, um, you know, they can uh, start, uh, start a family or start their life. And uh, away they go. So let's go make some more money here. As we starting to do a lot better here. Uh, we didn't eat though today, yeah, did we? But now we're done eating. Okay. So we're going to get this done here, and then um, I think we got to start taking out the other, um, other field and get some more money off of that. Depending on how much money we get off of this, we could think about getting some more uh, cows, too.
that steady income every day. We're selling eggs and selling milk, plus we'd be able to cook some more stuff. send me here. It's a transport quest. Uh, we should go back up to Lydia. But we'll drop off we'll drop off the tractor first or drop off the wagon first here. Alright, drop off that and then go back to Lydia and then go pick up the piece of equipment there. And I think well, it is only eight o'clock in the morning, so let's see how well we do here. I think we're doing okay for the first season anyways. As far as I know, there's only two more pieces of equipment that we gotta get, the cedar and the spreader. And then it's just making money. Yeah, when we go up to Lydia too, we can get, we can get gas for the tractor. Top it off, anyways, because we're at 62%. Just to make sure that we don't run out of fuel. The harvester should be fine because we don't drive it a lot. This tractor has been everywhere. I need to get a tractor that has a radio on it though. Know? I don't care if we got to strap down a, um, an old-fashioned boom box, you know, with duct tape or whatever.
Oh, wild boar. something. Let's go to Lydia now. So we're going all the way up here. Nope, oh, sorry man, I cut you off. I don't think those are the next two fields that we'll buy when we have the opportunity to buy them. Keep them close anyways to us. bubbles in my beer makes me happy when you are near tiny bubbles in my wine makes me happy makes me feel fine All right, let's get some fuel. All right. That's not too bad. Let's do that. And let's do that. So we are filled up at home. And we are filled up in the tractor. So that is good. Better hit the brakes, man. Coming through. So that last one was just used for buying fuel, which is needed, I guess. Alright, and this is a big field right here. Hmm. It's going to take us a while to go through. These are very tall uh, sunflower seeds.
Come on, Lydia. Gotta tell you about a dance. a little bit too late. Wasn't paying attention. I can't think about anything but William. Well, good job. You earned the fertilizer and helped the damsel in distress. Yay. You may be proud. Ah, so you're giving us the option to be proud. I don't know if I want to be proud. But, okay, we'll be proud today. Let's see, where is this uh, piece of machinery at? see here oh that's why does it say man manure spreaders there oh we just got to pick that up plow the field plow the field we don't want to plow fields tired of plowing fields all right so let's go back Take this thing all the way back home. Better stop, car. I'm coming. All right, what would be better? Let's go this way. Looks like there's a bunch of people standing in the water. Control here. Here we go. Come on. Need to just set like an autopilot. That would be nice. Oh, 
Huh? Don't get in my way. I'm gonna run you over. She got ahead of me. She's fast. Holy cow. You know what they say about fast women, though, right? Man, do I. I mean, it's like women, you know, they run through my head all the time. They dare not walk. Got me a spreader now. Okay, the yard is starting to get a little full here. to drive forward anyways. Yep, that's the fertilizer. So the fertilizer doesn't go there anyways. We need the... Uh, we need the uh, manure spreader. So we're gonna just put you here. All right, let's go get the let's go get the manure guy. Where was he at? He's up here, right? Yeah. Let's go back all the way over there now. Let's go get another piece of equipment. <laughs> 